We can use the union or union all operator in SQL to combine results from two or more select statements. Now what's important though is we combine these results. The results have to have the same number of columns in the same order and with similar data types. So here's what the syntax could look like. We'll have our first select statement and then union our second select statement to combine the, those results together. So here's an example. Let's say we have a suppliers table and a customers table. And in each of those, there's a field with a country listed in it. And maybe we want to combine those countries and have a consolidated list. So what we could do is say select country from suppliers, union select country from customers, the other table. And then maybe we order it by country, so it's alphabetical. So when we union it, here would be the list. And with union, it's going to eliminate duplicates. We only see those countries listed once. If we want to include the duplicates, we're going to use union all. So in this example, we'd see Germany and Ireland listed twice, and we use union all. So union, you're only getting unique values. And with union all, that's going to include duplicates. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click the subscribe button. And if you're interested in a SQL cheat sheet, you can find one over at CodyBaldwin.com.